I'm working on making these little strap clamps and I'm using a one, two, three block to set up the angle to mill the ends of them. But I'd really like to be able to drop some pins in here to make a repeatable fixture and so this doesn't wiggle around. So this is just a quick idea to make some fixture pins for a one, two, three block. I'm just using some drill bits basically as gauge pins because I don't have gauge pins and it seems like 1130 seconds is close but a little bit loose. 23 60 fourths is too big so I'm going to just kind of creep up on this measurement and get a nice tight fit in these holes. I don't think these are reamed so and I don't really know exactly what size they are. It's an import gauge block so it might be 8.75 millimeters. I'm just going to kind of creep up on it, keep checking until I get it to slide in there. I just found some random bits of scrap. This one is already turned to 3 8 so I'm going to start with that one, see how many I can get out of that. So I've got a carriage stop set. We'll just knock this down until it fits in the 1, 2, 3 block. I'm going to leave this at 3 8 just so that if I'm butting up against the bolt in one of the other holes, it'll match that and it won't fall down through the 1, 2, 3 block. So that's definitely not a precision fit because it fits in some of the holes but not others. I'm just going to do a spring pass on that and call it good enough. Now I'm just going to flip them around on the collet chuck, clean up the top a little bit, and that's it. These are kind of ugly little things. The surface finish is pretty terrible, and it's fairly soft metal. If I was going to use them a lot, it'd be good to use something a little harder. But for what I'm doing with them, I think they're going to work pretty well. And they're just going to go in a drawer when I'm not using them, and when I need them, I'll have them. So the verdict on these pins in terms of actually holding it straight, they're not real high precision. It doesn't help that they're only half an inch apart. But for doing something like this, it worked pretty well. It was worth the five minutes it took to knock those up. 